Hey, I'm Colt Westbrook with Walrus Audio. We're just going to go through the new stuff for 2015 with you. Uh, right here is our Bellwether Analog Delay, Bucket Brigade Chip. Eight of them in there, you can get up to 1,000 milliseconds of delay time achievable. A lot of time in the analog delays, you're going to have really dark, saturated repeats, which I love. But for people who don't love it, we added a tone control so that you can add some of your highs back into your repeats to get a more rhythmic delay sound. You've got your toggle option right here so that your expression control can manipulate time or repeats. And over here in the mod section, you can add rate and depth modulation to your trails. Here, right here's the luminary octave generator. Oh yeah, hold on, and tap tempo. You got tap tempo on analog delay. So, quarter notes, eighth notes, dotted eighth, triplets. Luminary octave generator, two sub octaves, two higher octaves. You got your wet and dry control in here. Right here is your attack control. You can strike the guitar and the octaves will come right in or you can turn the attack all the way down and the octaves will bloom in slowly with that knob all the way fully on. You got your filter right here. Kind of blends, and the, especially in the higher octaves, just puts a filter on the octaves to kind of blend them together. So, you know, you get real chimey, uh, almost piercing high octaves kind of when you're using an octave pedal. So this will really kind of smooth them out together. And the flutter really is just kind of like a rotary effect uh, to kind of add a little bit of an organ, organ signal, kind of organ vibe to your activated signal. Over here is the Vanguard phaser, and it's a it's a dual phaser. So your top right here is going to be a classic phaser, and then that phase signal is running into a second phaser down here, and you can toggle between like a very smooth phaser, kind of a pitch detuned phaser, and then a very aggressive uh, kind of a creepy phaser. So. I really, I really hate phaser, and so wanted to do a phaser that uh, that people are really gonna like, that I'm gonna like, that I'm gonna want on my board, and so instead of just a normal phase 
waveform that you always hear and you hear that as a cliche phaser, uh, that phaser is gonna go into the other phaser and so the series are gonna be, phaser is gonna work in series and kind of create just a, a bed of unrest, kind of a strange texture bed of phase uh, that's really fun to play with. And then right here is the Phoenix clean power supply that we have coming out. 15 outputs. There's uh, eight 9 volt 100 milliamp outputs, four 300 milliamp 9 volt outputs for your big Strymon units. And then there's uh, one toggle right here. You can toggle between 18 volt and 9 volt. And then down here you can toggle between 12 volt and 9 volt. So 15 outs power supply, courtesy out over here. And that's 2015.